Millions and millions of people are on the highway day by day, and trust us, not all of them get the opportunity to see some of the occurrences we've compiled on today's list, from the truck bopping to one of Kendrick Lamar's most famous tracks, to a dog enjoying a cool night ride. Here are 20 unusual highway incidents caught on camera. Traffic policeman falls asleep. Being a traffic cop is no walk in the park. These folks need to stay sharp, come rain or shine, to keep traffic flowing smoothly. But sometimes, even the most vigilant among us can't help but nod off. We all know that feeling when you're at work and exhaustion kicks in. It's tough, right? But what happens when a traffic cop, whose job demands constant alertness, falls asleep while standing? That's what got Malaysians talking. Recently, a video made the rounds online showing a Malaysian traffic cop dozing off while standing. In the clip, you can see him standing there, head dropping and swaying a bit. Thankfully, he was stationed safely by the roadside, away from any potential danger. The person filming the incident from their car even tried to wake him up, but it seemed like our officer was in a deep slumber. He continued to snooze with his head down even as cars passed by. Now, sleep deprivation might not be the biggest concern here, it's his safety. What if he collapsed on that busy road? According to a statement from the police department, this happened at the Uplands Roundabout. The police chief assured everyone that they'll be observing the officer's health condition for further action, and he thanked netizens for their concern about the officer's help. Before the police's statement, many Malaysians had already expressed their worry and sympathy. Some even suggested the possibility of narcolepsy, a sleep disorder, but there were also those who urged empathy highlighting that this officer might be unwell and attacking him personally wasn't the solution. Can't wait. When the going gets tough, you know what they say, the tough get going. The tough in this case refers to these guys who created a new route, shortcut, or should we say pathway for themselves and others. They were stuck in traffic, probably for hours. And they were like, you know what? I can't do this anymore. Hold my beer. They came down from their cars to remove some rails at the side of the road in order to create a passage and escape from traffic. The video keeps getting better every second as they slowly take out the rails and boom, the escape is done. The funny or ironic part of this video is that while everyone sat in their cars and watched the three guys as they worked, many of them followed their escape route when it was complete. Seems pretty unfair. They watched the guys take out the rails and even pass through it. There's no way that isn't against the law. We wonder if anyone ever caught these guys for their offense or not. Either way, thumbs up to them for their innovative thinking and a job well done. Incredible loading technique. Imagine driving down the highway and suddenly you spot a sight that makes you do a double take. Two daring men are holding on to a refrigerator at the back of a moving truck, defying, well, common sense. This isn't some Hollywood stunt, it's real life. These guys have transformed an ordinary truck ride into an extraordinary thrill ride. Instead of sensibly placing the fridge in the truck bed, they've opted for an open-end, high-speed adventure. You can't help but wonder how this idea came about. One thing we do know is that it was a costly adventure that left netizens with many questions. What would it have cost to buy straps and strap the refrigerator down? Why risk your lives? The hospital bills would cost way more than straps. It's also a dumb way to die if things go south. But as the saying goes, all's well that ends well. Let's just hope this brave fridge and our highway heroes made it to their destination without a scratch. Take away from this, when relocating, always ensure your possessions are securely stowed. Unless, of course, you're aiming to go viral on the highway. Car got struck under the bridge. Let's dive into another viral video that's got Malaysians buzzing. It shows a tow truck driver attempting to pass under a bridge with a Mercedes AMG GLC 43 on the back and things take an unexpected twist. As the tow truck squeezed under the 2.1 meter high bridge, the Mercedes AMG got stuck and that's when eyebrows started to raise. The driver of the tow truck, clearly in a dilemma, got out of the vehicle to assess the situation from behind. Then he hopped back in and started reversing. Now here's where things get wild. As the tow truck reverses, the roof of the Mercedes, worth a pretty penny, starts scraping against the bridge. Ouch! 
Some netizens suggested a quick fix, deflate the tires of both the tow truck and the Mercedes to make reversing smoother and prevent further damage. Smart thinking, right? But an Instagram user pointed out that this route isn't exactly a road, it's more of a makeshift path. And just when you thought the bridge had enough action, earlier this month, a lorry also found itself in a sticky situation under the same bridge, with its container jammed. The owner of the Mercedes later came forward, stating that the incident didn't seriously damage his car. He even gave a shout out to the coating shop for their good work. Whew, that was a close one. Hopping vehicle. In the middle of a busy highway, there's this small truck and it's stealing the show. This little guy's body is pouncing and grooving like it's got a mind of its own, all while Kendrick Lamar's loyalty is pumping out from its speakers. It's like the truck and the music are having their own dance-off right in the road. The truck's tires groove to the catchy tune, and the truck's body moves gracefully like an expert dancer, making everyone on the road take notice. We already know that the display got some drivers honking in a cheerful agreement, and others, well, rolling their windows down intrigued. We imagine the passerby nodding along to the music or busting out their spontaneous dance moves. A gang of bikers in cool leather jackets rolling up next to the truck, revving their engines, taking the roadside concert to a whole new level. And as the truck keeps grooving on the highway, the curious onlookers exchange surprised and amused looks. They're dying to know what's up with this moving dance party, who's driving, and how on earth this one-of-a-kind show happened on an otherwise ordinary day on the road. Thanks to this hopping vehicle, it's not just a road anymore, it's a stage, and the truck is the main character. Dancing Tire Someone said these tires have stanky leg syndrome. That's one explanation. Another person said it was a bit chilly outside, and the Ford shivered. The explanations are quite funny, but we know they don't make sense. So what does? What's wrong with the tires? Apparently, it's something called a death wobble. A death wobble is when your car starts shaking, wobbling, or vibrating like crazy while you're on the road, especially when you're going fast. It's not just about the little wiggle in your steering wheel when you hit a bump. The death wobble is like your whole vehicle has gone wild, uncontrollable, where it feels like you're about to lose control at any moment. It's pretty scary. While suspension and steering problems are the primary culprits, they're not the only factors. Anything that's bent or broken on your vehicle can potentially trigger this problem and it demands immediate repair or replacement. Even if your vehicle components are brand new, incorrect installation can introduce issues. Although improper vehicle alignment won't directly cause death wobble, it can worsen existing problems. However, it can lead to various other vehicle issues. Bottom line, keeping your alignment in check and your wheels balanced is still a must-do for a smooth ride. So this Ford driver had better get their car fixed. Now let's talk about improper vehicle alignment. Car with wrong alignment. You see things like this on the road and you wonder if your eyes are deceiving you or if the truck driver knows some car tricks you've never heard about. Well, and as much as this looks intriguing, it's a thing. It doesn't happen frequently, but it does happen. Some refer to it as a crab walk. Crab walk is a feature in which all four wheels on your vehicle steer together with the rear wheels mirroring the front wheels at an angle of up to 7 to 10 degrees in either direction, depending on your specific vehicle. This means you can move your truck diagonally. When you use crab walk, you can drive on tricky off-road paths or squeeze into tight parking spots with a big vehicle like this one, even though it's usually hard. However, there's something else, and it's known as bad wheel alignment. There are a few key reasons why your wheels might not be aligned properly. First. If your tires are underinflated, it messes with the height of your car and can throw it off. Second, rough impacts like hitting potholes or curbs can knock your wheels out of whack. Also, as your car ages, parts like suspension and wheel bearings wear down, which can mess with how your tires sit. Lastly, if you forgot to get a wheel alignment check last year, that can also lead to alignment issues. So keeping an eye on those factors is crucial for keeping your wheels aligned. And if your wheels aren't aligned right, this is how you'll know. First, if your car keeps drifting to one side when you're trying to drive straight, it's a red flag that your alignment might be off. The more it veers, the more urgent it is to get it fixed. But it's best to let a mechanic sort it out. If you hear your tires squealing while turning or accelerating, 
That's not normal, and it could be alignment trouble causing uneven tire wear. So get it checked. So yeah, there's definitely something wrong with the alignment of this car in this video. Cheetah racing the car. There's a less than 1% chance that you'll run into some certain animals on the streets. So when this happened, everyone went crazy. In the quiet state of Mutra, an unusual spectacle unfolded one sunny afternoon when an unexpected visitor decided to make a daring escape. It was none other than a magnificent cheetah, famous for its lightning speed and incredible agility, and decided it was time to break free from captivity. This graceful creature had simply had enough of being in captivity and yearned for the wild adventures for which it was born. As the cheetah dashed through the gates, it left everyone in awe of its incredible power and elegance. The chase was on, with this spotted speedster darting through the streets, effortlessly gliding through traffic. But things got even wilder when the cheetah ended up on a highway, racing alongside fast-moving cars. It seemed dead set on showing that it could outpace even the swiftest human-made machines. After all, we're talking about the fastest creature on the planet. The highway turned into an unexpected racetrack, and drivers couldn't believe their eyes as the cheetah kept up its astonishing pace. It was a reminder that in this state, where tranquility usually reigns, unexpected adventures could take place, leaving everyone with a story to tell about the day they raced a cheetah on the highway. There's a claim that the video is an optical illusion, but we prefer to think it's real. Now let's get ready for today's missing topic. You see some things and you know there's something unusual about them. This picture is one of those things. Is it even real? There's just something cartoonish about it. Have you noticed how the lady in the passenger seat appears larger than everything else in the image? Even the trees? It's as if the whole picture might have been altered. Or perhaps they edited the woman to appear larger than life. Any which way, this picture is absurd, and if the motorcyclist did find a giant along the way and decided to give them a ride, that would make for quite an extraordinary story. On a different note, this bike may suffer something called rear-end sagging. If you keep putting a lot of extra stuff in the back of your vehicle, like leaving heavy things on your bike for a long time, the springs back there might start to droop more. It's just how things work. Too much weight in the back, and those springs will start to sag. So yeah, we'll just stop there. What do you think? Do you think this picture is fake too? Let us know in the comments and don't forget to use the hashtag missing topic. Car overloaded with bags. Let's talk about a sensation that took social media by storm on October 1st, 2020. It wasn't a celebrity or a movie star. It was a car. Imagine the city of Moscow. Now imagine a worker from the Sadovold market embarking on an epic journey. Loaded up like a treasure chest, a car brimming with goods becomes the star of the show. This extraordinary moment was captured in a jaw-dropping video shared by Moskovsky. Watch this video and you'll spot a gray opal cruising on the highway. And here's the twist. It's jam-packed with piles of stuff. We mean the goods aren't just inside the car, they're even stacked up high on its roof. We learned that this opal was spotted on the Moscow Ring Road. The car's driver was on a mission to transport goods from one place to the next. Too bad for the driver he wasn't unabated on his trip. He was stopped by the police and slapped with a traffic ticket for carrying too much stuff in his vehicle. A clear message that no matter what, we've all got to play by the traffic rules. Creepy alien figure. Let's delve into an intriguing tale from the dead of night. In the eerie darkness of Jharkhand, eastern India, an otherworldly figure made an appearance on a bridge, and it's enough to make your hair stand on end. Imagine this, a spooky Friday night, and something bizarre shows up. This strange, human-like thing with long, skinny limbs, a super pale skin, and a bony body is taking slow steps on a bridge. People on motorcycles had to swerve to avoid it, and they couldn't believe their eyes. They locked eyes with this creepy being before it kept on its slow stroll. And despite all the people who witnessed it, nobody could agree on what they saw. Some folks thought it might be a ghost. Others said it could be a witch. And believe it or not, some even wondered if it was an alien paying a visit. The video made its way to Twitter, garnering nearly 5,000 views. But it did something else. It ignited a fierce debate. Not everyone was convinced of the paranormal. Someone suggested it was probably a naked human out for a moonlit stroll. This mystery really makes you wonder, was it a spooky ghost, 
a witch out at night, aliens paying a visit, or just a person under the creepy moonlight? Guess we'll never know. Dog was taking a ride. You'll think you've seen the wildest thing on the list and then something weirder comes up. This video is proof that this dog achieved something that's on the bucket list of dogs around the world. It's one thing they never get the chance to do, but this dog could finally tick it off after that night. This intriguing video was shared by a page called Forever Bangalore on Twitter. A passenger happened to capture this strange sight. What truly is mind-boggling is that the dog on the car didn't seem bothered by the ride at all. We're not sure if this was a planned stunt or just a random happening. Right now, the video has racked up more than 156,000 views and stirred up quite a storm of responses. A number of folks on the internet have called out the car's driver for putting an innocent animal in what could have been a risky situation. Many are upset that the driver didn't think things through before hitting the gas. In Bangalore, a city known for its tech wizardry and advancements, this unexpected escapade adds an unexpected twist to its tail. It's a fun reminder of the unpredictable and sometimes hilarious moments that make life in this bustling city so interesting. We don't know if it was planned or unplanned, but what we do know is that the dog will never forget this night. Paraglider Landing In Cape Town, where strong winds and stunning scenery are the norm, something pretty unexpected happened. Two paragliders, braving the city's notorious gusts, had a little detour and ended up making an unscheduled landing on Seapoint Main Road. Despite the challenging conditions, including some surprise thunder and lightning, these adventure seekers pulled off a safe landing. It turns out the extra strong wind was to blame for this, but their fast reflexes and expert skills made sure everything went smoothly. This didn't stop social media users from coming at them. People argued that they were probably high or drunk, and there was no way sober people would go on such an adventure in that weather. Some people are quite bold. The ward counselor confirmed that the paraglider team safely landed on the sidewalk, and the great news is that no one got hurt. Emergency services rushed to make sure they were okay, but it turned out they were all fine. Paragliding is a cool thing folks love to try in Cape Town. You get to see stunning views of the ocean, the city, and the pretty coastline. But this time, their adventure got spiced up with some natural fireworks, thunder and lightning. It must have been quite a memorable ride for the paragliders and a spectacular show for anyone who happened to watch. However, don't try this at home. Navigating the turns on the road effortlessly, popular industrialist Anand Mohendra was wowed by a captivating video he found on Twitter. In the video, a young man showcased his extraordinary balancing skills while riding a bicycle with a bundle of clothes balanced perfectly on his head. He couldn't hide his amazement and gave the young man a big thumbs up. He even compared him to a human Segway, as if he had a built-in gyroscope inside his body. He was truly fascinated by the incredible balance this young man displayed. And we don't blame him. How do you ride a bicycle like that? Well, he also expressed sadness about something important. In India, there are countless individuals with such remarkable talents for gymnastics or sports, but many of them go unnoticed and lack proper training. In the video, you can see the young man skillfully pedaling along a narrow village road, not using his hands at all. He concentrates entirely on keeping that bundle of clothes securely perched on his head. It's quite a sight. The video was shot from a car following the cyclist and the most exciting part comes when the cyclist leaves the road and heads toward the village, keeping us all curious. People on Twitter shared their admiration for the amazing cyclist and some even remembered their own childhood adventures. One user even admonished the government to explore the villages to discover hidden talents. We wonder if they ever took that advice. In this wild video, a man and a woman decided to take a bath while perched on a scooter waiting at a traffic signal. This bizarre incident has taken social media by storm. The woman had a green bucket and started showering herself and her companion, who was bravely steering the scooter, all while bewildered onlookers watched in disbelief. As the video continues to circulate, it grabbed the attention of local authorities. The police contemplated taking action against the rather reckless display of public affection, or should we say, public nonsense. The guy in the spotlight here is a YouTuber based in Mumbai. He later hopped on Instagram to say he was sorry. He then reassured his followers that he would take full responsibility for his actions and pay the necessary fine. 
The funny thing is, he only apologized for not wearing a helmet. Hilarious! This might sound weird, but it's a clear warning about how far some folks will go for fame on the internet. It shows how the love for social media can make people do crazy things, even if it's not safe or smart. Driver Dragging Trolley There really are many unbelievable things on the internet. In this video, a driver can be seen casually dragging a shopping trolley alongside his car while passing traffic cops who seem completely unfazed by the whole situation. It's quite a sight. However, before we get too carried away, it's important to note that this video is not recent, despite its viral status on social media. The city of Cape Town clarified that the video is old. How do they know? Well, the giveaway is the traffic officer's car, which is a 1996 Toyota Camry. The department stopped using these vehicles a long time ago. In the video, you can see a Ford Fiesta driving down a busy road, towing the trolley with its hazard lights on. The person shooting the video couldn't believe what they were seeing and mentioned how this sort of thing happens in this town in Cape Town. What's even more surprising is that a traffic cop was right there and they didn't seem to care at all. It's pretty absurd. As the trolley rolls past a female traffic officer, she simply watches it go by without any attempt to intervene. The video ends as the person recording makes a right turn. You might be wondering why the traffic officers didn't do anything about this strange scene. They were aware that the car towing the trolley wasn't just any car, it actually belonged to a security company and they had a job to do, moving those shopping trolleys for a retail store. So that's why they didn't bat an eye at the unusual sight. Trunk of a car holding a cement mixer What's going on in the world? It was a regular day in Buenos Aires, nothing out of the ordinary, or so it seemed. But then, out of the blue, something completely bizarre and potentially very dangerous happened, and lucky for us, it was all captured on video. And no, this isn't some scripted scene from a movie or a comedy show. This is real-life craziness playing out right in the busy suburbs. This woman, casually sitting in the trunk of a car, is holding a cement mixer. The bizarre incident occurred in Jose C. Paz, right in the middle of rush hour on a busy street. The crazy thing is, this woman was in the fast lane and she wasn't wearing any safety restraints. It's like something out of a comedy sketch, but it was happening for real. Any sudden break or acceleration could have led to a disastrous accident. To make matters worse, the trunk lid smacked her on the head as she rolled along and she seems to be wearing a smile on her face. How's this funny, ma'am? You could fall out and hit your head. Unsurprisingly, the video of this daring and dangerous escapade went viral on social media. People couldn't believe what they were seeing, just like we can also believe it. We're pretty sure the manufacturers of that car didn't picture a woman sitting in the trunk while they made it. Man got struck. We've got so many questions, but here's the first one. How on earth did he get on top of that car? Let's talk a bit about what we know. A strange shirtless guy who ended up in a seriously risky situation on top of a car partially underwater. This whole thing happened when regular rainy weather turned a normal road into a really risky water path. A little river, in fact. We want to believe that as the floodwaters rose, the man's car got partly soaked and he had no choice but to climb onto the roof. Shirtless and stuck, he had to deal with a strong current that could easily carry him off. It was a situation where he had to think fast to stay safe. Onlookers stood there, jaws dropping, as they witnessed this intense moment. It's like a loud wake-up call about how powerful nature can be and how quickly things can get dangerous when it pours heavily. But again, we aren't sure of this. The video begins and ends with him standing on the car, making a phone call to who knows. He doesn't seem scared or anything. He could be standing on his balcony for all he cares. He may have even transported himself across the water and onto the car, maybe to get a proper view of the damage caused by the rain. Sadly, we'll never know how he got there. Guy using his feet as signals. Picture this scenario. You're cruising down the expressway on your scooter, surrounded by the hustle and bustle of traffic. As you navigate through the lanes, something catches your eye up ahead. It's not your typical turn signal blinking on and off. Instead, you see a guy on a scooter who's come up with a rather unconventional method to indicate his left turns. The guy's not doing the regular stuff, like using his hands to show which way he's turning. Nope, he's got a whole different style. When he's about to turn left, 
he sticks his left foot out to the side, like he's saying I'm going that way. It's like he's dancing with the road, making up his moves as he goes along. It's pretty unique. You can't help but watch in fascination as the scooter rider elegantly signals his intentions with his foot, turning left with style. This is definitely not his first time on a scooter. He's been doing this for a while, long enough to have developed enough to have developed a unique style of signaling. Big up, sir. It's such a creative method. Thank <laughs> you.